Well, so then, then Bernie Madoff, who is now the, the arch villain of all time, apparently, had in the only way that he, he did that was to be totally in uh, vibrational alignment with what he was up to and pulled it off until he didn't. It's kind of astounding. What an amazing manifestation that was. Now, that doesn't look very happy for the rest uh, of us. Well, but what's interesting about that is that so many people were doing a lot of thriving right along with him during the whole process right. of that. Yeah. In other words, if people had been suffering or not thriving and therefore not part of the energy of it, it could not have reached the proportion that it did. Yeah, this is why it's so astounding. And but, then, and but then, you see, what we want to say to you, and we are certainly not defending his, his process or his plan in any way, but we want to say to you that, and maybe this will help you, and maybe it'll just blow this whole discussion up that we'll need five more days to sort it out, <laughs> but let's say it anyway. Everything that we've been describing about the three steps where contrast causes you to ask, and then source lines it up, and then you get into vibrational alignment with it, everything is just getting bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger there's no ending to it and what your economists want to say is that when things are going up they must come down and that defies the laws of the universe as we know them to be and we're going to say this carefully but we really mean it just to shake things up in some ways everything that happens not just economically but in terms of of the expansion of the universe could be seen as a sort of Ponzi scheme in the sense that I'm making something out of nothing and my belief in it is what's keeping it going and it isn't until I stop believing that it stops. <laughs>